New shooter coverage of IBC 2024 is sponsored by Sennheiser, Adamos, and b &H. Hi, it's Matt here for NewShooter.com at IBC 2024. I'm back with Lawrence at the Holy Land booth. Now, this is your upcoming, yet-to-be-released yes. C2 wireless system. Tell me about it. Yeah. So, as you can see, the receiver is massive. So, the biggest point, we got three units over here. So, two transmitter, one receiver. So, this is the whole set. So, the biggest thing about this product is two transmitters, one receiver. Right? So, this is like a for multi-cam uh, setup. I think that's the biggest point. And then, as you can see, because it's a 221, so we have to, we have the standard a power option is actually is V-mount. And we got both HDMI and SDI. We got a screen, of course, and that's another big thing, NDI for this product. And, and this one also offers standard uh, like UVC and also RTMP functions. Yep. And the range, of course. Yeah, what is the range? The range for the Cosmos C1 is 300 meters, but the C2 now is 1,000. So this is primarily going to be a good solution for people doing, you know, using multiple cameras who want to have it put it on a director's monitor and be able to input two, yeah. two feeds from the one receiver. Right. I will say this is more like for studios, like small studios. So you have like an on top camera and then you have one cam your main camera. So you don't have like to have two systems. So one will solve it. And also I think for small corporate events as well, when you have like, uh, you know, two cams. So um, you, this is just a one system, one solution for, you know, for that kind of application. Yeah. And in terms of when this is going to be available, wh wh when are we looking at? Uh, we are looking at early next year, I would say. Yeah. And, and any base indication yet of what the price could be? Uh, that one, we're still, yeah, still working on it. Yeah, because this is just a prototype and we might add some new features to it as well. So that one is really not, cert uh, like not certain yet.